Scour, did that, that hit in the first half get you going there? Yeah, uh, it knocked me into my, into my zone. But what is, I mean, Coach was saying that those types of plays are, are what get you going. I mean, why is that? Um, I don't, I'm not sure what it is. Um, you know, I don't like to take, you know, huge hits like that. Um, um, but when they happen, you know, it does kind of rattle me. Uh, not rattle me, but just kind of shake my cage and wake me up a little bit maybe. You know, that early in, in the game, the first series, I think it's good to take take a lick. Um, you, know, you don't want to take one like that, but it's good to hit, hit, hit the pads hit. Make you feel good that your guys kind of rallied behind you, particularly your own line after that shot. Yeah, yeah no doubt. No doubt. It's good to see, you know, because it gets them alive too, it, just as much as it does me. Um, you know, wakes everybody up. You know, hey, this is a this is a war, a war zone. But I was just say they know you can take that, but mm -hmm. to see that is kind of a reminder that hey, our quarterbacks and it's with us too. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, we're all in it together, and, and, and they show it. Scott, I know you never want to throw one, but is it kind of disappointing to have the interception streak broken on a ricochet? Yeah, yeah, it was. Um, but you know, I'd rather it happen when when we're up 38 nothing um, rather than happen the next week when it counts. So you know, um, it, it was inevitable. It was going to happen. Um, it's part of the game, and um, I'm glad it happened. I'm not glad it happened, but I'm glad it happened this week. Seems like the chemistry with Shelton was on full display today. What was he able to do out there for you? It's the game slowing down for him, and you, you can really tell by the conversations that we have um, uh, just about the game and, and about what we see out there and, and, and then the rest of it is his, his natural ability and he'll go get it. Speak to what you did running the ball in. I know you didn't have to run it that many times, but there was a few times on the zone read where that end just couldn't crash down and chase down your backs. Talk about that and how you're getting that with the running backs. Yeah, it, it's good. It's a work in progress. Um, you know, we take what they, I talk about it all the time, we take what they give us. Um, and if, if we see that, then we're going to take full advantage of it. Does that help you, though, that they can't pin their ears back and rush you as a, you know, yeah. you're going to pass? Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, every, every element of our game complements each other. You know, whether it's me running, window running, seven running, or um, putting the ball in the air, it all complements each other. And you like other teams seeing that on film, so they got to put that in the back right. of their mind. That's one thing that they have to focus on um, this next week in practice, so it's it, it's good. Is this team as prepared as you hoped it would be heading into Big 12 play? Yeah, I'm feeling really good about it. Um, uh, there's still a lot of work to be done, obviously. Um, there's always work to be done, and I can't wait back to get back to work, but um, uh, I'm happy to work.